Hi, a very good morning. This is Mrs. Hansa V. Chisani, the founder of Artistic Impressions. Artistic Impressions is an art academy that was founded in 2009 with a vision to educate children and adults in the field of art so that they can pursue it not only as a hobby but also as a profession. The other main thought that came to mind as I started Artistic Impressions is to spread the joy of doing art and creating a masterpiece and developing it to the best of the potential of every individual. We offer specified curriculum at the academy for every age group. Happy Art is the curriculum that we do for the little ones two and a half to five years of age. This particular curriculum is specially designed keeping in mind the finer motor and gross motor skill development of every child. It's on the basis of line forms and shapes and basic concepts of drawing that we teach children here. The basic group is designed keeping in mind that the child has made a progress from the happy art to the basic curriculum. Here, shapes are incorporated into making specific objects and figures. The basic level 1 curriculum is designed for kids for above 6 years of age. This curriculum keeps in mind the skill development in terms of teaching them art with the help of shapes and then creating an entire theme. As you watch these pictures closely, whatever the children have learned have been then created into a complete composition. Land, water, day, night, such important concepts of nature are developed here. We take the child to a realistic world where the child not only develops good imagination and concepts but also a way to express himself. At the basic level 2 curriculum, we introduce many concepts to children. These may be landscapes, these may also be theme-based paintings, it could be Warli art, cartooning and pencil shading which is a very important part of our curriculum. The skill to develop this is a gradual process and it takes about a year to complete this curriculum. The basic level 3 curriculum is designed keeping in mind that we need to cater to the children in a way that they use various techniques that they have learned in the previous curriculum. Human body figure proportion, application of colors, soft pastels, mixed media technique are all the important aspects that go into presenting art. So presentation here is given a lot of importance and proportion and perspective is also a very important part of this curriculum. In the year that the child spends completing the basic level 3 curriculum, somewhere and somehow we see that the child is ready for another level altogether. The pre-elementary curriculum is a preparatory to the elementary and intermediate grade exam. This has been designed keeping in mind that the children get a flavor of what they are going to study in the elementary and the intermediate government courses. The elementary course is specially the course that the government has designed keeping in mind that these children would have keen interest in art and would like to take up professions related to visual arts, fine arts, interiors, architecture and, and graphic designing. There are many courses that elementary lays a foundation to. Here we see that the children have developed the concepts of design, color theory, symmetry, human body figure proportion, also composition, shading with basically two mediums, be it soft pastels or water and poster colors. The intermediate curriculum has four major papers, still life, memory drawing, design, 
and nature. We see here that the children have transformed their basic drawing skills to a level that they get the best grade in the exam. The oil painting course at the academy is a year's course. We start with basic oil painting and then progress to advance. The basic oil painting course, every technique in terms of its sketching, the application of color, the layering and shading is taught in detail. The idea here is to get the individual to do this completely by herself. In the process of developing their skills from oil basic level to advanced level, what we see here is probably the best of the artwork that the students have put in. In terms of using textures, in terms of using layering and shading, in terms of designing and creating their own compositions. Fabric painting is another course that we offer at the academy and the work that you see here spells for itself that paintings can be created on fabrics too. Shading, mosaic and the best of the design compositions can be got even on the fabric as we decorate it and make it a part of our home decor. The course in charcoal painting is the basic and the advanced course. The basic course includes using the charcoal in black and white to create a varied effect. Gradation of, of color or gradation in black and white is the most important concept of teaching charcoal, not only developing the sketching and the application of charcoal, but understanding the theory that goes behind that. The colored charcoal is the advancement of the course from black and white to color. The applications, the gradation of color is taught in detail to create a portrait-like effect. The sketching and painting course for the adults is a course that is specially designed keeping in mind the needs of adults who have probably given away on their hobby as children and want to get back to art in full swing. The application of colors, the sketching technique is taught in detail so that we are able to extract the best out of the individuals and get some amazing paintings made. The reference that we use here is usually the artist's work depending on the subject that the individual is doing. It could be still life, nature, abstract art or even design. The sketching and painting course for school level is a course keeping in mind the needs of children who do not want to appear for any exam like the elementary and the intermediate. They want to learn art because they are really, really fond of drawing and painting. The course here caters to individuals' needs. The pictures are selected by the children and for the children. The teachers in the class assist in selection of pictures and teach them in terms of what they need to learn at that level and then take it to another level altogether. Catering to the needs of the portfolio, we choose subjects that are going to help children design individual themes and ideas. Every portfolio is unique, although it might be inspired by nature, by objects, by design or by any theme related to current affairs or social issues. The elective art curriculum is designed in keeping in mind the needs of the students who take up art in school at the 9th and the 10th standard, also the 11th and the 12th. These children take up portfolio designing post elective art curriculum usually. The elective art is a subject based curriculum where applied art, nature and still life form important subjects to lay the foundation of art. Uh, 
Uh, ever since I joined this uh, academy, say about six, seven months back, it's been a journey of self-discovery. I come across uh, Hansa Ma'am and the teachers as a very dedicated uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, group team, uh -huh. which has been able to bring out the best in me, things which I didn't know. They, they are very patient, the way uh, uh, they nurture, give you the freedom to express. And uh, this event has been an eye-opener. Uh, the uh, total talent of the entire academy is just before me. And I'm, I feel so encouraged. It's been a wonderful experience of self-discovery here. And uh, the workshop today, uh, again, has opened up another new possibility in the, the realm of art, something which I'd never tried before. So these are the exposures that one gets here. And uh, uh, I, I don't know, I, I think I'll continue to uh, be associated to be able to find uh, more, uh, discover more. Thank you. Hi, I uh, joined the Academy about a year back and I had not touched a brush since about 15 years and uh, uh, Artistic Impressions has given me the confidence of uh, starting my oil painting again and um, I've been pretty confident since a year that I have joined Artistic Impression and that's about it. Thank you so much. Uh, hi, I'm Rita and my daughter is in uh, learning here in academy and she has been here from last three years and she has a, uh, I mean she has lovely, she has learned everything, drawing, she's a uh, six years old but she draws very nicely all the drawings and apart from academy she has participated in the other drawings also and uh, she has won the competitions also and uh, what she is learning, I mean I cannot think also she can learn anywhere else. I am Malika Dissa and I've been going I am Malika Dissa and I've been going for the last four and a half years for to artistic impressions. I've learned how to uh, to do different textures like stripling, mosaic, pencil shading and many more. We learn how to color, shade and draw to the color, to the point. Uh, and all this credit goes to Hansa Ma'am because since I've taken a key interest in drawing because of her. Caroline Dissa, I have been under Hansa Ma'am for one and a half year. We, uh, she has taught me how to, uh, how to do uh, coloring and painting skills. She has also taught me how to uh, do pencil shading. Uh, Saida Dada. I'm a, I'm a self-taught uh, artist and I paint into, uh, uh, I like to paint uh, with acrylics because acrylic gives me a uh, lot of uh, uh, satisfaction because uh, I can experiment with it. I'm very happy today to come for this exhibition and it shows hard work, dedication by Madam Hansa and all the students have put in lot of uh, hard work and it all shows that this generation is very talented and we will have, India will have lot of artists in future. I wish all the very best to this institution and my heartiest congratulations to all the students and the teachers and especially Madam Hansa who has really put in hard work and so much of dedication. I look forward to be associated with this uh, institution. Uh, I have learned so much. I would, I'll be very honest and say I have learned so much from this exhibition and uh, I wish all the very best to uh, everybody who's connected with uh, this uh, exhibition. Thank you.